Telly, good morning. This is the part of the morning where I wish there was such a uh, such thing as smell vision because we are getting all the types of smells here this morning. Talking about barbecue, of course, in regards to tonight's food truck rally. And we are joined alongside Tina Schmidt here, uh, which is one of the four Schmidt's and Giggles Barbecue. Tina, thanks so much for having us this morning. No uh, so tell us a little bit about where we are this morning. We are inside the food truck. What are, what are we doing this morning? <laughs> uh, well, we are inside the food truck. Uh, we have Riley and Wyatt preparing um, some of our specialty items that will be on the menu tonight. Um, so Wyatt is making our Let's Talk About It, which is a pulled pork taco and a brisket taco topped with a Southwest slaw, pico de gallo, and an avocado crema. And then Riley over here is making our jalaquichos or jalaquichos or however everybody pronounces it. It's kind of <laughs> put on the menu on purpose to be a uh, giggle. Um, so he's making our jalaquichos and we'll give you guys a nice taste test of those. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait for that. But uh, <laughs> these guys are, 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 I gotta say, they are just very hands-on and, and well-crafted. I mean, that is not a typical dish for these these guys to be making, the, the kids of their age. <laughs> uh, well, no, they would say they're competition kids. Actually, they started doing competition barbecue before Steve and I started competing. Um, and they've both done very good in it. In fact, Wyatt did a little friendly competition against the coach this year and <laughs> actually beat both of his coaches in a pulled pork competition. So no, they, uh, they're they well versed and they know their way around the inside of the kitchen. Now you guys are still, uh, still fairly uh, brand new business. I mean, uh, you know, it, it's been a year now that you guys have been in business. Talk a little bit about, you know, taking part in tonight's uh, event. You know, what, what does it mean to be a part of a, a, a local community event? Um, yeah, it's, it's super exciting. We never in a million years thought like food truck rallies were going to be as popular as they are, first of all. Um, and it's an exciting event to be a part of. There's a great community support that comes out. Um, the band tonight's coming all the way from Milwaukee, so it should be great to have uh, some fun music to go with it and uh, just overall be with the community in the time where we're all still wearing masks and not really sure what to do with at least kind of a break fun for the evening. Absolutely. Well, well said. Tina, thank you so much for joining us here yeah, this morning. Thank you. And Wyatt and Riley, A plus on presentation. <laughs> we'll give it a taste test here later up coming in the hour, but uh, gosh, does that look so good. But tonight's food truck rally taking place at Ashwabame Park. They also are going to have some live entertainment between 5 and 8 p.m. tonight, so you will want to stay tuned for that. And of course, you know, with food as good looking as this, why not go to tonight's food truck rally? <laughs> Boy, I love pulled pork. It could be what's for breakfast. Thanks, Galvin.